Hey everybody. Hello everybody. Hello, hello. I think we are live now. I'm Erin Hart. I'm a registered nurse health coach and I empower women to get off of the dieting roller coaster and lose weight for the last time in a healthy and sustainable way so you can find peace with your food and your body, freedom from cravings, and the confidence to chase your dreams. So no fads, no gimmicks, quick fixes, or magic pills. <clears throat> you know, with the healthy real food method that I teach, I lost 125 pounds and I went from being morbidly obese, um, depressed, and powerless against, powerless against my cravings to energetic and healthy and confident in less than a year and you can achieve your health goals too. So if you're struggling with your sugar and flour free lifestyle or if you're confused and overwhelmed with all of the diets out there, um, if your relationship with food is holding you back from living the life that you want and <clears throat> you feel like healthy, uh, sustainable weight loss is impossible, I understand I've felt that way in the past before, but there is hope. So just hang in there with me. Every Monday I go live um, in my VIP group to share this message of hope. And and so <clears throat> um, I, I am excited to, to share this with you today. So it really is simple. Um, you know, when, when you think about losing 100 pounds or <laughs> losing 20 pounds or 15 pounds or changing your relationship with food, it can feel so overwhelming and, and you know, you may have tried a lot of different diets in the past and failed. And I, I get it. I was on that dieting roller coaster my whole life um, until I found, um, uh, you know, healthy real food, the, the simple strategy for achieving sustainable weight loss. And it, it is simple. It is simple. Simple doesn't necessarily mean easy, but it does become easy as you consistently execute your plan. And eventually it can become easy and effortless. And, um, but I understand that in the beginning it can be overwhelming. So what I want to outline for you today are just, I just want to go back to the basics. So this video is for you if you are new to the idea of living sugar and flour free, or if you've been living sugar and flour free for a while, but you're struggling. So <clears throat> um, I really love the quote by Vince Lombardi. So he was, uh, so at the start of training camp in 1961, Vince Lombardi, he walked into the locker room of the Green Bay Packers and um, he said to the, his team, what would become like a really iconic quote in sports history. He said, he held up a football and these are professional football players, right? He held up the football and he said, gentlemen, this is a football. So uh, Vince Lombardi, he was a hall of fame coach. They'd won national championships, right? Uh, but what he was wanting to um, to teach his players was the importance of going back to the fundamentals. So without the fundamentals, regardless of what our goal is, uh, we can definitely lose sight of our core values and we cannot get the results that we want. So, so let's get back to basics today. Uh, and I want you to, I invite you to just take a look at at your habits, uh, your program, and um, and as we talk about these fundamentals, what are you doing and what are you not doing? <clears throat> so think about that for a second. Maybe there's an area that you can improve that could help you to see dramatic shift in your results. So um, what I teach in my year of your year of you health coaching program to my clients is that to achieve extraordinary success. With a sustainable weight loss, you really need to first master your mindset, develop a winning strategy, and then consistently execute your plan. That is the path to success. And um, so today, as we're talking about um, going back to the basics, this is these are the fundamentals of a winning strategy. 
Um, they are evidence-based, they are proven, they are healthy. There are no fads or gimmicks here or quick fixes. Um, I, I was a nurse for 15 years and, and for me, when I discovered this sugar and flour free lifestyle, it almost seemed too easy, but amazingly that it works. So, <clears throat> uh, so basically, um, the way I lost 125 pounds and what I teach my clients that helps them to have such amazing results is to eat weighed or measured meals at meal times without snacking in between. Uh, that are made of an abundance of healthy, real food, uh, unprocessed food. So healthy, real food, what I mean by that is that, <clears throat> uh, you know, if you, is foods that are free from sugar and flour in the first three ingredients. So uh, freedom from cravings and control around your food, it is possible. By eating healthy real food um, that's free from processed sugar and flour so eating food in the form that God made it as close to that form as possible right that's um, uh, and refrain refraining from processed foods uh, can just absolutely change your life not only add life to, or add years to your life right and help you to live free from um, preventable diet related diseases but it also can just absolutely add um, life to your years the years that you have left help you to optimize your nutrition and you just feel so much better you have more energy and um and it's just an incredible lifestyle uh, and it's pretty simple, right? Like you don't have to count calories. You don't have to count macros or exercise a ton. Uh, it's just a, a very simplistic meal plan. Um, so our bodies are made of trillions of cells and every single cell in our body has a nutritional requirement. You literally are what you eat. So by eliminating processed foods, we really can optimize the nutrition and the function of our cells, tissues, organs, um, so that we can uh, feel our best. So some things to keep in mind <clears throat> um, are that you're wanting to eat the right food. You don't have to starve yourself to lose weight. Uh, losing weight can actually, you don't have to. You don't have to starve yourself. You can you can really lose weight um, without feeling hungry or having a lot of cravings. And by eliminating the sugar and flour from your diet, um, which are very highly addictive um, to some people, uh, it really helps to quiet down your brain so you're not having cravings all of the time. It's incredible. Um, at, you know, the first week that I started this lifestyle, and I kind of gave up sugar and flour, cold turkey. I eased into it a little bit, but then I kind of went all in and gave it up. And in that week, I just, oh, I just had signs of withdrawal. I was cranky and tired. And, you know, I was, um, I had body aches. It was really fascinating to me how um, my body, when I gave up sugar and flour, was demonstrating a similar signs and symptoms of people that I've cared for in the hospital who had withdrawed from uh, withdrawed from, from other addictive substances. And so sugar and flour, it really has been proven that the effect that it has on your brain is very similar to that of, um, of other drugs and um, addictive substances. So, um, so we want to, if you want to have less cravings, if you want to not feel insatiable hunger and um, out of control around your food, simply um, eliminating those processed foods and eating a variety of every food group of healthy real food, it can absolutely change your life and you can regain that control and have freedom from cravings again. So, um, so healthy real food is the key. Some things to keep in mind if you are living a sugar and flour free lifestyle is that there are good, better, best options, right? Of food that is compliant. Um, so <clears throat> just a simple way to remember what 
to try to fit into your diet every day are greens, beans, and berries. So those are the healthiest foods. If you can try to eat those every day, uh, you are going to live longer, you're going to feel better. Um, another acronym that's really helpful are, is G-BOMBS, G-B-O-M-B-S. And what that stands for, these are the foods that are the superfoods. So if you eat these every single day, it will prolong your life and, uh, and improve your health. So G stands for greens. Um, so cruciferous vegetables or leafy greens. Um, B, so greens, beans, onions, mushrooms, berries, and seeds. Uh, so just something to strive for, you know, you don't have to start by completely, um, being perfect at, at optimizing your nutrition when you're losing weight, but greens, beans, and berries, if you can at least start there, uh, you're going to see a huge change in how you feel. <clears throat> and again, just eating it in the unprocessed form. Your body does need a variety of every food group. You want to eat the rainbow every day. You want to have a variety of colors um, because those represent the different nu nutrients our bodies need. So trying to eat the rainbow and um, optimizing your nutrition by eating G-bombs, greens, beans, onions, mushrooms, berries, and seeds each day, that is the goal to strive for. <clears throat> but you know, when you're starting, Maybe you're just focusing on eliminating the highly processed sugar and flour foods. So when, when we eat healthy, real food, it really does give us that benefit of freedom from cravings and control again. Uh, so the second part of the meal plan that I teach are just eating weighed meals at mealtimes without snacking in between. And this is how you really can find peace with your food in your body and get the fastest results. So, um, so you can find peace with your food, freedom from constant food chatter and, um, achieve extraordinary results with sustainable weight loss by weighing your food or portioning your meal to one plate. Um, weighing your food with exactness though, what that really does for you is it bypasses the need for willpower. You know, you don't have to try to guess. And um, <clears throat> and if you can weigh your food with exactness according to the meal plan and the food list um, on a digital food scale, it's going to help you to have the peace to know that you are eating exactly what your body needs. Not any more, not any less, right? You don't want to starve yourself to weight loss. We don't want um, and you know, sometimes we can overeat when we're just eyeballing it, but, um, <clears throat> by following a meal plan, uh, you can just really trust the process instead of worrying about your body weight changes. If you weigh your food, you don't even need to weigh your body, uh, which is something that I really love. You know, it's just, you follow the process and the outcomes take care of itself. So weighing food with exactness um, will really help you to achieve faster results without compromising your nutritional needs. So eating at meal times at the table and avoiding avoiding snacking um, is it also just helps you to have a lot of peace that you are eating exactly what your body needs. You know, to me it doesn't feel restrictive. The way I like to think about it is that it's really um, it just frees me. I have um, peace to know that I'm getting enough. And that's kind of how I tell people when they ask me, like, why do you weigh your food? It's like, oh, I just want to make sure I'm eating enough, right? Not to restrict myself. So, <clears throat> um, so that's the, those are the basics of the meal plan. Um, the meal plan is just a structured blueprint that you can follow. Uh, that's proven to help you to overcome food addiction. So the meal plan that I teach to my clients, it's um, f it's um, based off of the food ad food addiction anonymous meal plan that's been used for decades, and in different lots of different programs. Um, Bright Line Eating uses it, Overeaters Anon Anonymous uses it, and you know <clears throat> the beauty of it is that 
um, we know it works um, and that it's healthy. <coughs> so uh, it's also something that's very customizable. So you can, you can adjust it to work for your lifestyle. There is no one size fits all meal plan, but I do encourage people to start with the written meal plan as it is um, and give it a good go before making any modifications. Um, so uh, to give you an example of what a women's weight loss meal plan looks like, uh, for breakfast you would eat um, a protein, a grain, and a fruit. Um, I like to include an optional vegetable, four ounces. Uh, just, you know, to have that option of more veggies is, you can never go wrong there. Um, lunch. <clears throat> um, would be like a protein, a uh, fruit, a fat, and veggies, and then dinner, you know, protein, veggies, and a fat. So it's very simple, and it's just a blueprint each day that you can choose those elements from the food list. You don't have to do any complicated recipes or shakes or, or you know, um, fake food. It's just all healthy, real food, and it's so effective at helping you lose weight in a healthy way. Um, while it is simple, again, I understand that it can be overwhelming to change your health and your lifestyle. So, um, I just want you to know that if you do need more support, I'm absolutely here for you. Or if you've been living this lifestyle and you're struggling with the all or nothing mentality or perfectionism, that is exactly what I help people to overcome. So in my 12 month, um, year of you coaching program, it helps you to really to become the person that you want to be. Um, to improve your, your relationship with food and your body and to transform your life with a sugar and flour free lifestyle. Uh, you will learn how to master your mindset, how to develop a winning strategy, <clears throat> and how to consi consistently execute your plan uh, so that you can have a sustainable, uh, sustainable results. So with the guidance, support, and accountability that I offer, <coughs> you will achieve um, extraordinary success with your mental, emotional, spiritual, and physical health this year. So be sure to sign up for a free, uh, no obligation, um, weight loss strategy coaching call with me. I would love to sit down with you and talk about your goals and um, answer any questions that you have about your program. <clears throat> you know, I just want you to know that if you're struggling or if you're overwhelmed, there is hope. You can absolutely achieve this goal. And um, with support and community, it makes it so much faster, easier, and way more fun. So have a great day and I hope to hear from you. If you do want to sign up for a coaching call, you can go to my website at erinhearthealthcoaching.com. Have a great day. Bye guys.